Yes, thank you, <clears throat> Madam President. You know, um, Tine Kasek mentioned Greece and Italy. We all seen the court cases in Greece. The uh, accused have been acquitted, the courts have been closed. So if the Greens want to compliment Greece on the independence of the judiciary there, they can do so in a press release, but not through a debate. We could even do a press release together, if you would like. But the EPP is always ready to debate migration, because there are plenty of reasons to do so. 330,000 illegal border crossings in 2022. A more than 136% increase in the Western Balkan route, over 100,000 asylum applications per month, the highest numbers since 2016. We should debate these alarming numbers, but that is unfortunately not the focus of this debate, and we cannot ever only debate NGOs, humanitarian aspects, and search and rescues, and ignore all the rest. So this Parliament wants a holistic approach to migration. Let's also debate holistically. The search and rescue contact group will be reconvened this month. Next month we'll have the special EU summit on migration. So instead of this rushed debate this week, let's have a deeper, a wider, a more comprehensive debate next month in our plenary on migration. Thank you. Thank you. Yerun, I put the request to a vote by roll call and I open the vote. Vote is closed and it is adopted and therefore the Commission statement will be uh, added and the sitting will be extended to 11pm.